Here on second and nine, a quick toss to Fleming, and it goes through his hands incomplete. Third and long coming up. Was Penny Vogue. And tumbles forward down to the 31 yard line. Kenny Logan. Second and seven. Oatesfall again with the target. It's Willie Miller, who is a quarterback turned into wide receiver with the first down. Miller in motion. Just again, couldn't get away from the tackle after a short pickup. Three. Oatesfall keeps it, had trouble with it, slings it out to Miller. Pass is complete. Wow, the former. Four-man rush. High, caught, and dropped. And dropped. It was never a catch. Jordan Moore was not the. If you're wondering, yes, he is related to the Iceman. George Gervin, the Cousins, both from Detroit. Riley Leonard gets it to Waters out of the backfield. And Waters inside the 20. And they do. And they get it. This is Waters. Now they'll have to use that timeout. Uh-oh. The man in motion now reverses field. Coleman. Trying to rip the ball out. That was Craig Young, number 15. Third down and six. Third down and six for Duke. Opening possession of our second half. Leonard. Caught. That's more. One quarterback to another. Jordan Moore. Yep. Jared Russ was in motion. And over the middle is Hutchinson. He brought one who had the touchdown over the middle. He's looking for the X-Man. Got him. And X is going to give it to you, but he dropped it. Quarter. Over the middle to Hutchinson again. And he is met. At the 15 by Kenny Logan Jr. Hutchinson's in the slot. Decker under pressure throws to Hutchinson. He caught it. And, and boy, and he Decker's pressured. Short. Logan. His tailback is Kendra Miller. On a first down throw, and he's got it for Quentin Johnston. They wanted to get him the ball. They got him there for... On first down, a run. Miller keeps his feet. He's whirling across the 35-yard line. It took Burroughs and Logan to knock him down. And two the year before in his three seasons at TCU. First down throw, Duggan clean pocket. It is Johnston on the cross. He breaks a tackle, and there goes Johnston with that athleticism as he's finally tackled. Second down, they'll give him 10. And it's a run for Duggan, and he is hit again by Kenny Logan, who's been very active in that secondary so far. Prowess to begin the year. Big plays galore last week. Duggan with time. He loads up and he throws, and he's got Johnston in space across the 40 into Kenny Logan. It's flying across the field. Came over from Tulsa after seven years there, and a good strong run from Kendra Miller on first down into Lorenzo McCaskill. Be second down about one. He had a tackle for loss earlier. Duggan to throw. Here is Johnston sidestepping one and cutting inside across the 40. It'll be third down. Duggan, the throw down the middle, and that is right on time. Now the ball comes out. It is loose on the deck, fumbled by Spivey. He's such great body control, and that one was way easier. Duggan does hand it off, and it is Miller, who is very close to the line to gain. I was angry. Shoulder pads north and south. Why not go there again with tempo? Miller runs into Logan, and what a collision that was inside the five. Yeah, those the kickoff with the penalty. TCU has half of the field to go. Duggan to throw. He's got Johnston again, and he is a broken tackle machine. Possessions would be the goal there. Low snap. Duggan 
Let's it rip down the middle for Johnston. That was a sizzler. The safeties so far so good. Play fake. Gabriel throwing again and another completion across the middle. And that's Drake Stoops. You can hear the crowd respond to Stoops with the catch. Well, he was in the protocol and they don't hit the quarterback during practice. Throws that one quickly and it's complete inside the five for an Oklahoma first down. It'll be first and goal. That's Marvin Mims. Yeah. Normal things. Had they been normal, this would be your typical homecoming game, right? Gabriel yeah, that completes right. that one to Braden Willis. For home. College career at the University of Tennessee. They got a big game today, that's for sure. That completion inside the five down to about the two and a half. Marvin Mims has been very involved in the get a game. Here's Bob. I mean, Drake has really turned into a good player. Yeah. He's an important part of this team across the middle and another completion. That's Willis. He can block and he can catch. That one is as bad as you'll get. The third down, Gabriel hands it off and a nice cut for a first down and more. Eric Gray has done some excellent running in this. Then made another good move at the end of the play. Barnes comes in and they'll give it to Barnes. He breaks more tackles. Bounces outside inside the 25. Stoppable. This is you. really, really yeah. conservative. And they hand it off and get a nice gain out into the open field to midfield. To the 45 to the 40 and inside the 40. Side. Quickly under center. Barnes again. Barnes is not going to get there. So the Kansas defense comes up with a huge stop after all that. Kenny Logan. They've had a lot of good offensive teams since then. Play fake. Gabriel across the middle. Another perfect pass. And this one caught by Drake Stoops for an OU first down. Yeah, run pass option. And off left side, bouncing it. Eric Gray. And he'll get tackled across the 20 just a couple of yards short of the first. So first down with the penalty. Gabriel. Interception. Picked off by Kenny Logan. And Kenny Logan back across midfield. Dylan Gabriel. Gabriel in the shotgun and that one is complete. He threw the little slant to Drake Stoops with some pressure coming. That was a nice delivery for a first. Another handoff this time Kansas was there to meet the ball carrier. Eric State and TCU they're undefeated. They're in the top 15. They're going to play here in a few minutes. Huge game. Well this was a huge game for Oklahoma. Yeah for a different reason touchdowns averaging 23 yards of completion on first down they give us to Richard Reese and he powers inside the 30 Kenny Logan this stop Reese Logan at quarterback is have a negative play here's Reese patient run gets close to the original line of scrimmage and it'll bring up a third and long here that's what it's like throwing like 80 yards speed option Reese and he's going to move the chains 11 more for Reese. And playing a lot of football on Sundays. And he's also the safety net for Shapin, who fires a strike over the middle, and it's through the hands of Javon Gibson. Now that might be about to begin. First and 10, Baylor from the Kansas 25. Here comes Reese. And the true freshman takes it to the 18, a gain of seven. He's become the belt. Two tight ends and a fullback. Reese got a block. From Dylan Doyle, the linebacker, did he get enough? Uh, Here's the blitz. Here's a run. Here's an opening. And a first down, a gain of Richard seven Reese yards. Here, it's Reese, Reese again. Here. Play clock down to five. Doyle, the fullback, he gets the call. And Doyle pushes across midfield a first down. This is that drive where if you go get points, you put the game away. On third down, a first down. Twelve more for Richard. Burrows there, five cutting him down. They're going to get it back to Robinson. Found the hole. Robinson couldn't stay up, but another big gain. First down to the 48. Picks up 12 more. Just look at every record he could possibly have. It's insane. This time they're going to hand it off to Keelan Robinson. And he was nearly wrapped up before reversing fields. Gets enough, though, picks up two, and moves the stop. Last thing you want is that dude running at you, and he's got the ball again. Johnson, cut it upfield, inside.
inside the 10, finally dragging tacklers down to the and eight. And it Johnson. Stutter step, tripped out. Nice play made as Kenny Logan Jr. gets him down. Just two yards downfield when the ball was released. So I don't think that should have been called. And it took the touchdown from Casey off the ball. Confidence hit there for mm -hmm. Jacob Borchilla. Tough situation for him. And while yours rainbow delivery is hauled in by Jordan Whittington. Ewers looking to pass. And this time completes for Sanders. Picks up one yard. But man, this is this is exactly what I would assume you'd want as the coach on the program. Four man rush. Hand it. Robinson. Chet to tackler. Robinson moving through. Bijan Robinson is gonna be marked. Downs on 19 attempts. Give it to him. Add more. Robinson on the outside. And he forced out of bounds just shy of a first down. That great effort by Kenny. Texas so threatening again. Swing it back to Whittington. This is where he's dangerous with the ball in his hands and space. He will stumble forward, picks up five. A ton of yardage. Absolutely. On the ground. Vaughn. Nice. Uh, hello. <laughs> How do you do? Oh, Q, Timmy. Double deuce. Takes leverage on the outside, but when that guy squats on him, you got to turn with him in, in concert. For the corner, in the end zone, knocked away beautifully by Kenny Logan. Vaughn, the intended receiver. This is Deuce's time. It's time to shine. Short of the five. I don't that call. First and goal. Vaughn. Got covered up that time. Tremendous penetration from Logan, the safety. Ohio State staying in the hunt. Look at Howard go. I love saving that until this point. You know, you. Vaughn remains the setback. Six and a half to play. Such an effective inside runner, man. Would be so slight. If this is. Giddens. That's a little bit of a. Uh, Vaughn, yeah, that's a bit of a Vaughn move. Put his foot in the ground and changed direction. To get the Cole sits down in the middle of zone coverage right there to get the first. Little flip forward and going to gain another. Dubinian with the carry and he'll pick up eight yards. Defensively, they need to, they need to, some big plays defensively. He's a the guy they're going to count on. Jefferson dumps it off short. Dubinian's been very active in the offense here. Certain Ben. So you see the belief in the program, the excitement in the Kansas program. You see that in the crowd here today. Huge Kansas crowd supporting their football team and getting excited about the future and what Lance Lightbolt is building. Outside the tackle, hands it off. Great movement by this Arkansas line. They're getting great movement. Knocked down here with 6.27 to go in the quarter. Blitz, the double-A gap look here. And bailed out of it. And another big hit on the play as Dubinion. Now the quarterback Jefferson. Getting off once again. Dubinion finding open space to rumble and got down near the 50 yard that you have. It's your system being able to adjust to the personnel you have and put your players in position to make plays. And Kendall's done that. They've done that. And I'll tell you what, I've been really impressed with they Cam Little, the kicker, the sophomore from Moore, Oklahoma. And once again, going to keep it on the ground to get it across the 35-yard line. Now, inside 20. Jefferson short. I'm surprised we didn't use the timeout after that. Even, even when the clock stops at first. See, oh, they're going to hand it off again. That's green. See if they can get an explosive the play. 50, gets across the 30 to the 20 before he's knocked out.